question of the day is this. When you give a presentation, whether it's a sales presentation, a speech, um, some kind of talk to the troops, do you speak the way you write or do you speak the way you talk? What exactly does that mean? One of the challenges I've seen, and I'm going to focus on, on presentation skills and speaking because that's, that's the kind of coaching I do. Uh, one of the biggest challenges I see is that people will write out their talks first, and I think that's a great idea. You want to get your ideas on paper. One of the most important lessons I've ever learned is that we should sp write for the uh, eye and speak for the ear. It's, and what does that mean? Well, it's something that looks good in prose, that may look good in a novel, does not sound good to the ear. It doesn't sound conversational and natural. I was reminded of that today when I was working with one of my clients, Rex. Rex is originally from Appalachia. And when you think of Appalachia, in your mind, what kind of dialect and in, in personality do you, um, do you see in your mind? I've always seen somebody who's laid back, kind of, talks at a slower pace, very thoughtful, and that's exactly how Rex is, very smart man. And when he was going through his talk today that we had originally written for him, it occurred to me that there were parts that sounded like they were written in a book. There were other aspects of the talk where he sounded conversational. So I stopped him and I said, here's your homework, Rex. You're going to go back through this script and you're going to change those phrases that sound like they were written for a novel and you're going to put them in Rex speak. And he agreed. He could feel the difference. I could hear it in him when he was uh, going through passages that he had reworked and tweaked to put, uh, put it in his own voice. When you present, when you talk to groups of any size, are you talking the way you write? which does not connect with people or do you talk are you speaking the way you talk in everyday language that is the conversational style that is how people connect with you because it feels real and it feels authentic leave your comments below i'd love to hear some of your experiences talking with groups and connecting because you knew you were feeling real or maybe when you didn't feel like you were making that bond with people because you weren't sounding like yourself Hopefully this has been helpful and we'll talk to you in our next tip.